Okay, here's another game of League of Legends coming away. This time from the top lane. As Swain. So it's been a long time since I played this guy, and I imagine the Katarina might be thinking I'm the midliner, so we might be able to pull a fast one on them here. Just need to hope that the top laner picks here before they can realize I'm Swain and go accordingly. Anyway, do we have any overlap here? Actually, it looks like ten unique bands. Wow. You don't see that often. Also a little concerned that the Draven got through. Hopefully the guy knows how to play it. So do I want to turn on my Hecarim skin or not? That is the question. Nah, it could be a Lucian top. Don't really want to say anything, but it could be. Unfortunately, here's when they're going to realize I'm the top laner. That goes an interesting choice. I don't know why he's so popular all of a sudden. Okay, it could be Lee Top. Could be Zack. We'll see. But anyway, I went ahead and picked this up, so let's equip it. The one Swain skin I actually like. The other ones don't really look that impressive. Plus, I think this one changes your particles from being pink colored to green. Oh yeah, in case you're wondering about my rune page, it's... Mostly magic pen reds, scaling armor yellow, scaling armor blues, and AP quins. I'm gonna say it's probably Lee Top. Oh, and Zach. Okay. Hmm. I that does catch me a little off guard. But well, I still have the MR stuff. I just have to draw this out long enough for that to ramp up. Level 6 will be the turning point. It's very possible I could get an early gank if you notice Lee Sin is running Thunderlords. So I'm not entirely sure I really want to push early, but we'll see. There may be some sort of revelation on the map that will encourage me to do so. Because all the other times when I play Swain, if you ever notice, I grab Q, and as soon as I get there, I start pushing, so I can try to draw some pressure. Here, I'm not entirely sure I want to. Oh, I just noticed there's three plat borders in this game. <sighs> so I'm not going to grab any skills just yet. As for Echo, I don't really think he can jungle that well these days, that's why I don't really play him, even though he was kind of interesting, he was a little different. Overall, I guess Riot wants him in the mid, and they're gonna change things until he does, so... Oh well. Meantime, you can marvel at my new skin. I think it was just put on sale for the first time, and that's when I grabbed it. I've been waiting a long time for this. 30 seconds until minions spawn. So I get 17 mana back on last hit. Overall, to be completely honest, I wouldn't mind if Lissandra had a passive kind of like this, so you could bring her costs somewhat in line or something, because... Yeah, I'm not in any desire to pick her up. Minions have spawned. And so far, we're not seeing any sort of invade. So it looks like it may be a fairly tame start. Wait until the 30-second mark, and then we move. 
Wrong runes are masteries, eh? Oh. Okay. <laughs> Didn't even notice he was seen in Fountain. Gonna grab E. So when you take E, that's when you just want to harass the guy instead of push. I missed that minion thanks to you. Not really thanks to him, I want to blame someone. screwed up here royally. Okay, we still got it though. So if you remember what I was talking about, he was aiming for the same one I was, when instead he should be aiming for a different one. A different blob, that is. Damn. Anyway, that's good enough. So I was wondering right here if these two are pre-made, because that's another trip already to the top. But overall we get Thresh, and we're still pressuring over here. We nope, we're not getting cat, I don't think. Actually, maybe Echo can get her.
So unfortunately they got a little too close for me to actually freeze. My destination is absolute. Crap, too early. So I think he's going to miss most of those. My thoughts exactly. So far, it looks like Lee is only ganking top. So he's running individual potions instead of a refillable at this point. Overall, there isn't really much I can do to kill him, but I'm not too worried, because as long as I just play this a little passively, I should still be fine in the long term. My destination is absolute. Was that Lee? So it goes up to one and a quarter. Going somewhere, bro? So if he wants to jump aggressively like that, then yeah, I can punish him by binding him under tower. 84... There we go. So I have enough for my Roa now. And here's where part things are starting up, picking up. So 
So I'm going to put this over here. I should put the Duran ring down here too. Run, pony! I don't know if Ghost was actually necessary, but oh well. I don't really think I can do anything to save Echo, so Zack's gained a kill here. Not sure what he was thinking there. So I kind of want to group these up so I can never move them. Didn't actually mean to take a tower shot, but it doesn't really matter. So Zack is down bot. Gotta help myself to first blood tower then. That one minion got through. Oh, heck, I'm, I should attack the thing I'm attacking? Stop the presses. Crud. I tried to stop the auto attack there, but oh well. Zach's passer should be coming up shortly. Efficient strategy. An enemy has been slain. Two hundred and fifty stacks, he's yet to cash out. When he does, it's gonna be a big payday, but as is, he's not getting anything out of his passive, I'm afraid. Thank you for feeding him, Hecarim. <laughs> Dumbass. And they get the dragon, too. So, this is what I mean by I really hate it when other people are jungling in my games, because they do all sorts of weird and stupid crap.
he cashed out or no, he died. <sighs> so I'm gonna wait here for a mana. I'm five steps there we go. I was thinking about teleporting to a minion, it's just I don't trust those two to actually do anything. So I got cat at the very least. I'm with my laser beak bird. Hopefully you guys actually get the whole laser beak reference. Got her with my torment, I think. I'm actually gonna stay for the tower. So if I want the damage amplification, I need to go for the Abyssal Mask. I can go for Banshee's Veil here for sheer AP, and because mm, this is still a support item, I think. Want me to check it, or you want me to take it? Hundred and ten mana back on champion killer assist. Dude, I can go one V two. So I'm a very popular man from here on out. Should look to making an exit stage left. Would like to go for that. Wow. That's a pricey item, damn it. I miss the old Abyssal Scepter. At least I could get the components.
killing spree. They may surrender right there. Go on the dagger, cat. It'll be fun. Going somewhere slick? So the pony is taking the top lane for us. Blue buff has expired. Oh yeah. Before I forget. I miss when all Swain's cooldowns were 10 seconds. Landed that a little earlier, he might have probably taken her down to like one tenth health. Anyway, we have the superior team fight between me and Echo. We also have Hecarim who can run through the middle. Speaking of Hecarim, they can kill Echo right here. We're gonna imagine that axe hurt. Here, I'll stand still. Come to me, Lee. And he catches out! Jump in! Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Oh well. 
She got a kill. Boy. This isn't even close. I'm hoping they'll award that for me because I want to teleport to something. I haven't gotten any value out of the spell. Yeah, this entire game. <sighs> I can't teleport to blue wards. Happen in the game now. So Zach is currently two eight eight. Good enough for me. Damn. It's gonna be hard to see, but I am dancing on there. No, I'm not. No! Now they'll never know who the boss is. I failed. My one task. So, solid S. Kind of expected based on just how thoroughly I crushed that Zack. If you didn't know anybody, you'd probably think I splattered him like a ball of slime or something. So most damage dealt. Damage taken, went to Hecarim and then Echo. Well, since they actually went until they died, I guess. So, yeah, I think the Banshee change may actually be good for Swain. Not so much for Diana, though. Oh well. <laughs> So I'll leave things on that note. I'm the Hero of Light. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.